Well, hello, welcome again to our reading of the uh, Greek New Testament, reading Hebrews uh, and chapter 12, and I'll just finish off the last section here from 20, verses 25 to the end of this chapter. Blepete me paritases de to la lunta. So, um, look, lest paritasete you... Um, refuse this is from um this is from par i te am i so look um do not ref it could be lest you refuse i think it's a subjunctive here ton la lunta the one who is speaking ega ekenoi uk ex ephugon epiges parai tesaminoi ton crema tis donta Polumalon hemes hoi ton ap urenon apo strephomenoi. For if they, the, if that lot, it's a kainos, so it's referring back to the um, Old Testament people, I think. So if they did not escape from ek fugo, uh, if those upon the earth did not escape, paratisaminoi, it's that same verb again, having refused, ton krematis donta, krematis do is to warn, so the one who was warning them, by how much more will you, um, well, you have to understand, not escape, uh, Abot strephominoi, turning away uh, the one who is warning from the heavens. So the, the, this is uh, formed from the same structure as the previous bit. So by how much more will the ones having turned away understand uh, not escape uh, being warned by the one from heaven, who uh, he phone ten gain er salusen toti nun de ap angel tai legon eti hapax ego seis aseso u monon ten gain ala kai ton urinon. Now the who must refer back to this ton back from here, which is this one who is warning, I think. So, whose voice uh, at that time, Toti, is salusin, from saluo to shake. At that time, whose voice shook the the earth, but now, ep angeltai, he has promised, this is a perfect from middle, I think, from ep angelamai, so, who has promised, saying, uh, we never get another quotation here, and the quotation here, I think, is from Judges, is it? Uh, no, sorry, from Haggai. Eti uh, hapax ego say so. So, I will shake, this is from Sayo, it's a future, for I will shake, uh, once still further, so I will uh, shake yet once ag again not only the earth but also the heaven. Tode eti hapax deloi, and then in brackets, tain, ton salio menon metathesen hos pepoi en menon hinamene tome saliomena. It's a little bit tricky, this bit. The, he's referring back to the quote, or he or she is referring back to the quotation here. So, Todet, we would say, the words, eti hapax, still once again, that would be an in inverted commas in English, make plain, this is from De Lo'o, it's an Omicron contract verb, they make plain, the metathesin, this is the um, the transformation uh, literally of, or perhaps, um, so the word once more 
makes clear or perhaps refers to or indicates the uh, metathesin, the change or perhaps the removing of that which is being shaken um, as think that which has been made uh, in other words, the created things. So it's this is a very tricky sentence to get into English. You probably need some dashes here in English. So the words um, uh, once again make clear a the removing of that which is which can be shaken. I think literally is being shaken. I.e. So this hose here is almost like I.e. that which has been created, that which has been made. Uh, Hina, in order that the things which are being shaken, sorry, the, the things which are not being shaken might remain. So just to put that together again, it's quite difficult here. The, it's li literally, the word once more indicates the removing of that which can be shaken, i.e. the created things, so that what cannot be shaken might remain and I suggest you have a look at the commentaries to expound that further Dio Basilean a saluton paralambanontes echomen caring de heis that true omen euaristos to theo meta eulabeas kai debus Kaigahothios Hemon Poor Cat Analiscon. Dio, we've seen before, it's just Dia plus Hot, for which reason or wherefore, having received from Paralembano a kingdom which is at saluton, so alpha privative, and then that cell root, the saluo root of shaking. You'll notice it's a two-termination adjective because it's a, com com it's a combination of two parts, and but it is agreeing with the feminine basileon, so that's why it ends in on. So wherefore, having received a kingdom which cannot be shaken, echomen, hortatory subjunctive, let us have grace or let us be grateful. Uh, or sorry, let let us have have favour or grace, dehas, through which, or by means of which, uh, latruomen, another hortatory subjunctive from latruo, we might serve, it takes a dative, God, you are restos in a pleasing way, meta eulabeas, eulabea is to, to fear, eulabea is the abstract, means fear or reverence perhaps, so with reverence, kai deus, this is a genitive from deos, third declension neuter, meaning fear. Uh, so let us serve God uh, in a pleasing way with uh, reverence and awe. And then the final sentence for this chapter, kai gachotheos hemon poor kata kat analiskon. Kat, uh, analisko is to spend, or hence can mean to consume, and the kata completely consume, all consuming. So this last line here, for our God is an all consuming poor fire. And that's the end of chapter 12.